I'm Kyle Keel. We have the hats and the headband on oh, for yeah, a that's reason. Right. Yeah, yeah, because <laughs> hey, St. Patrick's Day is coming up, and the annual St. Patrick's Day race in downtown Davenport is less than a month away. Mm -hmm. And of course, it's the race that supports many programs of KSI, yeah. the Center for Active Seniors. Yeah, Laura Kopp is president and CEO of KSI, and she is joining us now. Laura, welcome back. Thank you. We've missed you around. Yeah. Here. I've missed you too. It's been a while. <laughs> yeah, we were excited to talk about this. Yeah. This is the big event. Right. It's like the first race of the season in the Quad Cities. We're big race people. Yes. That's what I've heard. That's yeah. what I've heard. So I expect to see everyone down there regardless yes. of what the weather is. Mm. Yep, absolutely. <laughs> 42nd annual St. Patrick's 42nd. Day race uh, wow. benefiting KSI. Uh, so talk a little bit about it. Hopefully this year we have perfect weather. <laughs> We're not, not paying attention to that man. Yeah. Pay no attention to that man. I've I've postponed winter until further notice. I so, saw that. I yes. saw that. We're so, going uh, we'll, to let everyone we'll know. We'll see if we can extend that into mid-March. Yeah. I appreciate that. It's the least you could do. <laughs> yeah. Yes, it's our 42nd year this year. Most folks know this is the largest fundraiser that we host every year to support senior services here in our community. KSI is the area's only comprehensive senior center. We're one of only two that is nationally accredited in the state of Iowa. And we help thousands of seniors every year to live their best lives mm -hmm. and age as well as they can. So the race is just another fun way to help support that. And yeah. fun is key here. This is <laughs> right. not like some of the other races in the Quad Cities where you have to go up some steep hills, go down some steep hills. It's it's more flat. Right. It's kind of like a training race, if yeah. you will. There it's you fast, it's flat, and it's fun. As Morgan had said, it's the first one of spring, so yeah. folks love to use it as a way to kind of guess at their, their Gauge fitness where they're level at. and where yeah. you need to go in order to get to the bigger races like the Bix and the Marathon. So And, and truly, the colder it is, the faster you run. There you go. So, That's what I've heard. Yeah. I, don't, I don't run. I'm not a runner. I probably couldn't run from <laughs> Motivation to, to get to the you finish line. You could do it. <laughs> Kyle, last year, didn't you, didn't you kind of do some emceeing? I did, yeah. I emceed with Laura, and I got on top of the <laughs> scaffolding. When it was like Ooh, negative ten, eight. yeah, negative eight wind chill. So uh, I got up there the year before that. I ran. Uh, Redrick did the emceeing, and it was bitterly cold then. Yep. Uh, the prior two years obviously were canceled, and then mm -hmm. the one before that, I think we were finally okay in the twenties. So right. let's get at least okay twenty degrees. 20. I, yeah. I'll go for that. Yeah, hey, I'll there go you go. For Better that. than April. Right. Right. <laughs> right, exactly. All right. Well, it's a lot of fun. Uh, the race itself, of course, but you guys do a lot of fun festivities post race. So uh, what can people expect when they sign up and then they get to kind of party? After Afterwards. Yeah, absolutely. So we're going to be having our after party indoors again this year. Yeah. It was such a big hit the yeah. last few years that <laughs> yes, I'm a big absolutely. fan of that. Yes. After being up on that scaffolding, we have Funktastic Five that's coming nice. for our after party. We'll be having a free beer for folks that were registered for the race. Um, folks that were not registered but want to come down and see the band, want to enjoy the festivities mm -hmm. before the parade, it's $10 a person. Okay. And 100% of those proceeds are going back again to support seniors here in the Quad Cities. We also will be selling trinkets during race packet pickup, okay. which is Friday okay. at Quesa and Saturday down at the hotel right before the race. So most of these things have been handmade by members at KSI, our That's knitting and crocheting cool. club, our quilting club. And um, again, the sale of these things go back to supporting seniors. Absolutely. We're just taking a quick look at the route map. We talked about how it's flat and how it's fast. It yes. is pretty easy if you're just getting into running. I mean, it's like a really great route. It really yeah. is. It's just an out and back. And yeah. It goes really fast. It goes really fast. And then... Uh, Laura was kind enough to bring some of the items that you can purchase when you register. I just love this and wanted to hold it up <laughs> because members members at KSI created these right. things. And remember, we sale. do have a costume contest for yes. all three races, right. so it's yeah. important that you look your best <laughs> for yes. St. Patrick's Day. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Well, I wanted to mention something quickly, which is um, the trivia night that you guys have coming up this week. Uh, the good news is... You guys are full. We're sold out. We're sold That's out. Awesome. We're sold out. Um, but wanted to mention it because it's just another way that uh, people can show their support for KSI. You guys recently had a little bit of a disaster. You had a, a sprinkler pipe burst in the building. We did. Uh, we're looking at uh, some of the video there, um, the aftermath of that. Just a really scary, mm -hmm. unfortunate day. Um, so just, Laura, a good idea for people to follow you guys on Facebook and see what you have coming up that they can participate in. Absolutely. And you can visit KSISeniors.org as well. We have a calendar of our events that is happening every month. We change that up every month. We have close to 8,000 activities every year, yeah. so there really is something for yeah. everybody, and we have just been so supported by the community following that water damage, so we're mm -hmm. very excited and uh, looking forward to St. Patrick's Day. Nice yeah. to see the community showing the support, that's for sure. Yeah, yeah it's really great. Well, show your support by signing up for this race. 42nd St. Patrick's Day race supporting KSI is Saturday, March 16th. Again, there is, I don't think we talked about this actually, there's a tot trot you can sign up for, oh, yeah. a one-mile 
mile family fun run and then you co of course have the 5k that we talked about yeah. uh, for more information uh, and to register head to qcstpatricksdayrace.com Laura thank you so thank much you. thank you